Hey buddy, Crow back again, and I've got the At Games Legends Pinball out. And what we're going to do is look at the first table in the Natural History Pinball Pack. Uh, most recent pack. It's been a long time since I've done one of these videos. It actually took me a really long time to get this all set up. Uh, but yeah, we're going to take a look at Amazonia. So let's uh, pop up into this. I'll play a couple games of this and, uh, you know, we'll see what footage I wind up putting in this video. Uh, I've never, I haven't played this yet. This is the very first time I'm actually taking a peek at it. Uh, natural I've, history. There we Amazonia. go. Amazonia. Licensed by natural history. I don't know what natural history is. I, I really don't. Uh, but it is a licensed table. You know what? I just realized I never wiped down the screen. So I'm going to do that really quick. All right. So we're all cleaned up here. And yes, this was made by Magic Pixel. It is more in line with the deluxe tables that they do. So if you f remember the Taito uh, tables that Magic Pixel did, and maybe you were disappointed because they were more like EM and solid state tables rather than more modern tables. Well, this pack is um, is just full of deluxe tables. So this is like really, really uh, complicated. More ramps, rails, even more complicated than you would really see in tables today, I think, um, because we got flippers all over the place here. This is really the first time I'm really good, good, good look at it, because um, all I saw a little bit of each trailer uh, of each table was in the trailer. This line of tight targets right here kind of reminds me of uh, El Dorado. But I see we got a ramp here for a river combo. We got an upper play field up here with like, wow, three fl flippers up in the upper play field. Uh, yeah, um, Magic Pixel with these deluxe tables really does have a lot of stuff in them. Um, and then, uh, as you can see on the back box, uh, I think you can see it on the back box. Yes, I was just making sure I was still filming that. But uh, we have the, the video uh, display rather than a DMD. So, kind of ultra modern, even if it's a little bit overcomplicated. But let's uh, play some of this. Let's hit start. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at the fish. I, okay, so now we're getting um, tables in here that are. Um, that are showing things that you could really only show in a video game. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. That, I gotta wait. Oh, I might have to turn the volume down just a little bit. No, I'm sure it's fine. I'm not gonna mess with the volume now. We are. Uh, it, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, I, I. I mean, I, I. This is completely different than the last time I set it up. So we'll see how this turns out. And of course, I'm gonna film all four tables like this before I even get see how. <laughs> so, okay, because I'm gonna do it. The, that's the smart way to do it, right? Yeah, just a lot of flippers all over the place, so that could be like the one, so far the one, com um, I wouldn't want to say complaint, but um, criticism I could give this table it might be over com overly complicated, <laughs> but this is probably the most, um, with the tables in this table pack, this may be the more, most complicated tables we're going to get. As you can see by the fish jumping around in the, the river there. <laughs> All right, that's a one. Let's go over there and see what we can get over there. <laughs> but yeah, this does look okay. One million. It's uh, yeah, I'm used to seeing like this kind of layout with um, Zachary of Pinball's deluxe tables. It just thrown me off to see it here on an act, the Act Games Legends Pinball. Oh, up the ramp and around. Okay, okay. Oh, I for, I'm accidentally. I, it's been a while since I played this too. My hands were accidentally resting on the uh, nudge button. Uh, I was like, why is it nudging? Oh yeah, I'm nudging it. <laughs> I gotta keep my eye on the, uh, the camera that's recording the back box because that has a half an hour time limit. <laughs> so if that disappears at any time, You'll know why. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to play a couple games of this, and um, you'll see my first game here. And then maybe another game. Just, uh, you know, so I can... I couldn't understand what that was. <laughs> I had 
to stop when I heard the voice because I was like, whose voice is that? Because I'll, I'll uh, let a little cat out of the bag. I did record some voices for additional ta tables in Zachary of Pinball, or for Magic Pixel. But that was some time ago. Now I don't even remember what tables they were for. <laughs> so for a second I was like, oh wait, is that my voice? I, I'm pretty sure it's not. <laughs> One knee. Yeah, it's def definitely not my voice. <laughs> One knee. All right. You know what? What? It, I wonder if I did do one of the tables in this pack, and I didn't even realize it. Well, I, if we get to, if there's a table that is themed the way I think it is, I might, I might have to point out that I did the voice for that. All right. Well, that was obviously crap for my uh, first game here, but I'm gonna play this a bit more, and um, I'll play. I'll show you another game, perhaps. Oh, you know, I just realized those two rows over there, they descend. Like when you get in one row, the whole row moves down. Shoot, okay, well, the ball's coming back, thank you. Okay, I don't know if this... Some, usually the spinner will... It's gotta be... I think I see the spot I need to hit it, but... I think it's something you can only hit from one of the upper flippers. But how do you get this... that, that reliably shoot from one of those upper flippers? Combo. Oh, I see! That's the flipper I wanted to shoot it from! <laughs> right here, there we go. And they're out. At least that shot's pretty easy. Well, that was weird. Ah, I should have nudged. I thought it was gonna hit. Uh, I thought it was gonna hit the flipper. Okay, well, I want to get up there. I thought for sure that was going to be the shot, but it's not. Combo. I guess on this flipper we'll just shoot from that. Double combo. Oh, oh, come on, I thought I was going to go the other way. See, if I get that last one, I want to see if that moves down. Oh, it went in there! Okay, are we in upper playfield? Yes, we are. We're up in there. That is a tough shot to make, and uh, now we're back. But you have to make it from that flipper that's like right in the middle of the table. I think the dog decided she didn't like combo. Double combo. Oh, okay. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Triple combo. There's actually a couple shots to make from the upper left flipper that can uh, lead the ball into a couple different areas. Ah, crap. This table is good. I like this one. I don't know 
why I'm doing that. I should be... Oh, okay. I don't think you're supposed to get it to go that way, but... that. I lose the ball anytime soon. The ball's coming back. It sounds like a drum roll like, when I'm about to hit the ball. And you know what? That, those drop targets didn't drop, but they're all flashing. Nothing's happening, so I wonder if I have to do something to make them, to reactivate them. Army ant. What is our one spot left? Oh, I'm doing a mission. That's what's going on. See, I'm not even paying attention to the, the video screen. Okay, I completed. I didn't even know I started a mode. Because the music didn't change, it didn't announce anything that um, I was actually starting a mode or anything. So I had no idea I had a mode starting. <laughs> okay, so I guess the mode is over. That would explain why... I want to get that last one. Didn't I hit it? That's one. There we go. Yes, it did drop. Okay, the yellow targets did drop. We got the green targets. So I wonder if those dropped, there's something else behind her. But that's a risky maneuver because. Jeez. <laughs> that's gonna bounce right back to the flippers really quick. I see, it's the same output, and whether or not it goes left or right. Gee, I don't know how the mode started. There we go, we're back up to the upper play field. Oh no! Snake isn't eating my ball this game. So hit. Oh man. Ugh. Bop, bop, bop. Okay, up there. Oh, there we go. Snake ate the ball. Um. Nice. Ball one is locked, okay? Good. There's one more left there, so let's go for it. Okay. The, the yellow ones just came back. <laughs> ah, kickback is active, so we're good there. And I don't think that used up my shoot again. Oh, it almost went up in there. running low on time on my my uh, camera that's showing the um okay so we're gonna okay there we go quick stutter there while i uh, reset the uh, recording on the top one that's good we're... okay it looks like we started a new mission Hit the flashing bumpers three times, okay. Oh, wait, where's the ball? <laughs> Way to not hit the flashing bumpers. Oh, I see the... Um, wait a minute. Did I finish it? I guess I did. 
100 for extra bar. Okay, so like, I think... There we go, I think I get an extra bar. Or maybe... Uh, 60... Oh wait, I thought I had 98. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, kickback is on, so we're good there. Oh no, there it goes. <laughs> There we go. I think that's the, um... Well, that's certainly the game I'm going to be putting in the video. I got to the upper play field, figure that out. Uh, I like how... I mean, I had the snake eating the ball before, but I just wanted to make sure I got that in that game. Um, apparently... I'm still not 100% sure what starts the modes, but it might be the spinner? I'm not 100% sure on that. Sometimes... It, it is a spinner a lot of times that starts the missions in these magic pixels. Um, tables. But uh, yeah, the, these row targets, they're lower, but then when you hit the second row, it comes back up. So I thought there'd be something else behind there. But maybe there is, and I just didn't see it, but uh, not when I played it. It looks like there's a ball lock hole back here, too, but I I did not get that free, so I don't know what would have started that. Uh, but yeah, hitting this ball up in here comes down here, and whether or not it falls left or right just depends on the angle uh, I suppose the ball comes at. More times it's going to come out to the right. Uh, but yeah, I like this one. It's it, it looks comp like a lot of Magic Pixels deluxe tables. It looks really complicated at first, and yeah, it can be complicated. But just by playing it, you'll figure out where the ball's going um, at, for each shot you make. Because you know, a lot of times with a lot of these deluxe tables, you don't know. You hit the ball somewhere, and you have no idea where that ball's coming out. For example, I thought for sure getting to the upper play field was this shot here, where in fact it's just a. A, um, a habit trail that comes back, return back to the flipper here, whereas the, to get to the upper play field is this shot way over here. <laughs> and it feeds the ball way up into the top there. Um, so yeah, I, I do like this one. I, I So far we're off to a good start with this Natural History Pinball Pack. Uh, it is a $25 pack with three other tables, so it is a bit pricey, but then again, all the tables on the At Games Legends uh, pinball are, and I, I don't know if I mentioned it, but this is for the At Games Legends pinball uh, devices. This is only playable on anything that's At Games Legends, uh, you know, like the arcade unit or the core system, anything At Games Legends related uh but I, the only thing i have is the pinball which is why i got cameras recording screens so leave it at that thanks for watching i'll see you next time bye